Once again, this past weekend, we learned there are two groups of people on Earth that never retire. Prize fighters and pro anglers. Once again, welcome back to your weekly or almost weekly dose of fishing news you can't use. Let's jump right into it. Check out this 125 pound world record carp. That's right, this aquatic dinosaur was caught by Matt Nelling on Perry Lake in Missouri on July 24th. Now, as you look at this fish, remember he caught, did not catch it with a rod and reel, he shot it with a bow and arrow, and local authorities want to remind you that these are an invasive species that they encourage you to help remove from the waterway. So great job, Matt, and that thing is ridiculous. Several Bass Pro Tour anglers will not be competing this week on Lake Champlain. The original announcement due to privacy protocol did not include a reason, but since the announcement was made, at least five of those anglers have come out personally and said the reason I'm not there is due to COVID. So we wish thoughts and prayers and a speedy recovery for all those anglers and their families. And once again, I mean, I've said this a lot, I'm sure you have too, COVID. In other tournament news, with 52 pounds, three ounces, Bill Perkins takes the win last week at the Oneida Bassmaster Open. Now all the way over to the West Coast where Andrew Loberg won the Toyota Series event on the California Delta with 55 pounds, 11 ounces. And last but definitely not least, once again this past weekend we learned there are two groups of people on earth that never retire. Prize fighters and pro anglers. The recently retired Mike Iaconelli took a win at the Bass Nation Kayak Series powered by Tourney X on their upper Chesapeake Bay. Not only is this incredible and amazing, what a feat that Mike Iaconelli has done, but to be honest, it's not really that shocking. I mean, you guys do know his slogan, right? Never give up! Never give up! 